the sun is shining. It's a beautiful day. I've got two flights planned today, well actually three flights, a uh, training flight with a student in the Arrow and then we're taking a, a Warrior to maintenance and flying it back hopefully as well. Hi there, we've got our bag of tricks all here. Also going to get myself a charging cable. This is the one we want. There she is. Go back in all of her glory on a beautiful summer's day. Let's go fly. <laughs> So tell me what's happening today. Well, unfortunately we have had a little bit of a problem with the control panel, which has been a little bit stiff uh, to maneuver. So I tried a quick fix previously of just cleaning the shafts of the control panel with some fuel and then just some silicon um, and I just wiped it through, which was a great quick fix but unfortunately it's not solved the actual main problem. So we think that there's some buildup of sediment behind the actual control panel where the um, control column shaft goes through. So we're heading up to Thurrock today and we're going to get our awesome maintenance guy Ian to um, have a little look and clean it out. Just gonna have a look at the fuel in here. Difficult to see but we've got uh, tabs in there. So that's about 17 gallons about uh, just over an hour and a half's worth flying time really. Other side as well, tabs again. Check the oil now and we have here about seven quarts of oil, more than enough for a flight there and back. She usually doesn't go after the first four, but we'll give her a try. Clear prop! said she normally needs just two more. What happened there? Yeah, um, played around with the throttle a little bit too much. Let's try again. Morning, Perrick's information, Golf Charlie Charlie, Yankee Yankee outbound. Golf Yankee Yankee, Perrick's information, hello, pass message. Golf Charlie Charlie, Yankee Yankee, PA 2820B from um, Ferrox to Thurrock, requesting airfield information and taxi. Bravo 1, Bravo, and 24 left with QNH 1019. Well, thank you. Golf Yankee Yankee, Bravo 1, power checks complete. Golf Yankee Yankee, Fork 7000. 7,000 Golf Yankee Yankee. Golf Yankee Yankee, Cessna late downwind, there's also a PA20 inbound from Ockham about to join through the overhead. Take off at your discretion, incident wind 150 degrees, 5 knots. Visual with the downwind traffic and we'll line up and take off Golf Yankee Yankee. Alright, T's and P's are in the green and speed's alive. And we're coming up to 50 and we're going to rotate. Pilot three back to QNH and report Juliet received on first contact with begin approach on 129 at decimal 405. Okay, so we've got Juliet 1019 and we're going to give that information to the begin approach 129 decimal 405. Begin approach, Golf Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee is over Epsom race course with Juliet 1019 and request basic service and zone transit. Golf Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee, begin approach, stand by, call you back. So just, just. Golf Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee, pass your message. 
Or Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankees, PA28, Ferric to Thurrock, just over Epsom Racecourse, 2000 feet, 1019, routing uh, through your overhead, request safe transit. Copy Yankee Yankee, Q1H, 1019, basic service, Squawk 7047. 1019, basic service, 7047, Golf Yankee Yankee. Yankee North Beam Kenley 2100 feet. Okay, Yankee Yankee Transit approved. Report overhead begin not below altitude 2000 feet. Report overhead not below 2000 feet. Okay, Yankee Yankee. Okay, Yankee Yankee overhead altitude 2100 feet. We'll uh, report Swanley. Golf Yankee Yankee Roger. Changing south end 130 decimal 780. Oh, thank you, thank you. Have a good day. Bye bye. Here we are at Thurrock then, we've just had the uh, control column has been fixed, the guy's dabbed a little bit of WD-40 on it and told us that that should sort things out. Okay, so before we go, I'm uh, going to have a look at the fuel, make sure we've got enough left. We're expecting it's only slightly below tabs, about an inch that side. Maybe not even quite that far below. Yep, that one's on tabs. Where are we off to now? Uh, we're off to Maypole, which I believe is in um, Kent. Yeah, it's very, very near Canterbury. Um, so we've spoken to the chap on the phone. Seems very nice. Recommended a local pub. And, and there's uh, a beach nearby, just in case. I wouldn't say it's within walking distance, though. Hmm. Well, we'll see when we get there, because yeah, well, it is very, very hot today. It is very hot today. Um, mm. So we're going to get airborne. It's probably, what, 20 minute flight? 16 minutes if we go direct as the warrior flies. Yeah, okay. <laughs> well, <laughs> off we go. Thurrock traffic, Golf Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee's taxiing to hold short of the runway. Thurrock traffic, Golf Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee backtracking uh, runway 2. In terms of Maypole then, he said we join on a right hand downwind from runway 20. Okay. At a height of less than a thousand feet. Right. We'll get airborne. Uh, the moment we're airborne, get in touch with South End. Uh, request basic service, request a zone transit, and see what they say. Mm -hmm. Sure, they'll be more than happy to oblige. Direct traffic of Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankees lined up runway uh, two zero. So the parking brake is engaged. Uh, we've got T's and P's green. The mags are on both. Going to advance that throttle. Make sure the brakes are holding, which they are. Up to two thousand RPM. There you have it. Car peat hot. We see a drop of no more than hundred RPM. Back to cold. Up to two thousand it goes. Mags are on both. We go to left. It's a drop of about hundred. No more. Back to both. Back to the right again. Slightly higher drop there, but nothing to be concerned about. Back to both. T's and P's are green. Our suction is reading uh, within limits. Bringing that back down now to idle. Direct traffic, Golf Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee is taking off. And release. Takeoff power is set. Uh, speed is looking like it's coming alive. T's and P's are green. And there we have liftoff. Stage of flap away and two stage of flap away. Direct traffic, Golf Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee departing to the south. 
South M Radar, Golf Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee Basic Service and Zone Transit, please. Golf Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee, South M Radar. Golf Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee PA28, Thurrock to Maypole, just south of Thurrock, altitude 1000 feet, 1019er. Request Zone Transit on a direct track to Maypole with two on board. Golf Yankee Yankee, sorry that transmission was broken. Copy to your inbound Maypole, confirm the second arrest. Hey firm, uh, from Thurrock to Maypole, just departed Thurrock at this time at 1100 feet, request Zone Transit. Golf Yankee Yankee Basic Service, QNH is 1018. Squawk 5063. 1018, basic service 5063. Go off, Yankee Yankee. Well, Charlie Charlie Yankee Yankee, clear to cross, out of control air space, direct Maypole, VFR, not above altitude 2400 feet. Clear to cross, direct Maypole, VFR, not above 2400 feet. Go off, Yankee Yankee. Go off, Yankee Yankee, correct, entry control air space in 3 miles, radar control service. Radar control in 3 miles, go off, Yankee Yankee. Stone is dry and there's a shadow on the ground. So it's not raining and it's sunny. I'd say it's a pretty accurate assessment to be honest. Okay, we've had a nice afternoon. Uh, we're going to just sign out in the visitor's log and then head back to Fair Oaks. Yankee Yankee taking off runway 20. Airspeed's live, T's P's green, uh, take off power is set. Accelerating ground effect and airborne. Left turn onto a heading of south. Away we go. One stage of flap can go away. Two stage of flap can now go away. Now let her accelerate 75, our best rate of climb speed. And once we reach 500 feet on the QFE, that's when we'll do our turn to the right.
Do you land at discretion? 180 degrees, 10 knots. that she has perfectly lined this aircraft up with its parking stand. We're about to find out just how good that claim is. Is parking brake off? The parking brake off and it's perfectly in line. All right. Yeah, I'll give, Pretty you, damn good. I'll give you a seven out of 10, right. Pretty damn Let's give us a push. Oh, that's half a foot off, <laughs> which is by no means bad. Pretty damn good.